Welcome to J-Hook Magic. I'm Jess. If you're new here, welcome! Thank you so much for stumbling along my channel and coming to hang out with me. I truly appreciate it. Um, I hope you enjoy being here and hanging out. If you haven't already, please like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you know when new videos have been posted. And if it's not your first time here, welcome back, my Yarny friends. I'm so happy you came to come. Wait, I'm so happy you came to hang out with me. Okay, we're getting there. <laughs> I broke there for a second, but I'm okay. Hello, hello, and welcome, everybody. Goodbye, October. Hello, November. Welcome to November, everybody. Um, this is crazy. Holiday season is upon us. Crazy, crazy. Um, I don't know if you guys noticed, but I finished my hot off the griddle hat. Uh, this was from Heather at Strings and Threads. I will put her uh, link in the description down below so you can go check her out. Check out her tutorial. It's amazing. And whip one up. It was a lot of fun. I love how it came out. It's it's so soft and I did have to go up to a J hook though just because my tension is so tight and <laughs> it was literally like I could not oh so I had a, I had like up to here done and I had to rip it all out and redo it. But that's okay. I'm glad I did. And I'm also glad do I have the Let's see if I have my um here it is. I'm also glad that it used all the colors. Like it went um like this darker tan to like a kind of off-white and then to the gray. And this was using a Karen cake. I can't remember the name of it, but uh these are all three colors. And I'm so glad that the way that it worked out, I got all three colors in there. So that was cool. And uh, yeah, so I got that done. So I'm happy that I get to wear this. And yeah. Uh, so it is Wednesday. So it's Whip Wednesday, my work in progress. Still on the shawl, y'all. But, so, um, I don't know if you guys remember, but when I was working on the shawl, it just wasn't long enough, so I wanted to make it longer. So, I have added an extra nine rows. Yes, an extra nine rows onto this. So, let me show you. I love this uh, ombre effect. So I added nine rows. I put it on. It's long. I am going to gift this to my friend. Uh, she just got a new job. And um, I just thought it would be a nice gift to, you know, say, Congrats and good luck with your new job. And it is an office job, so she'll be sitting. And she's always cold, so. And she's, like, smaller than I am, but, like, taller. So I think this is going to work out perfect for her. So I'm so excited. Like I said, I added the nine rows. But I'm so excited because I get to start that, um, the scallop part on it. Let me see if I have. Where did I put? Oh, my God, guys. I have everything everywhere. found it okay so I get to start working on this part which is the one thing that really caught my eye with this pattern I just think that is such a beautiful edging and um and then once I finish this for her I'm gonna make one for myself I don't know if I want to do solid or I'm thinking uh they have a really nice 
ombre purple. I was thinking of maybe doing that. We'll see. So I'm still working on the shawl, but I'm so excited that I get to start working on the scallop part. So hopefully I could show you guys that finish soon. And um, yeah, sorry I wasn't on here um, yesterday. I had such a bad migraine. I woke up with such a bad migraine and it got to the point where it was so bad I was getting sick and oh, it was horrible. I basically did nothing all day. I just laid around. So thank God I'm feeling better today because that was horrible. But um, uh, at the end of the video, I will post some pictures from uh, Halloween from our trick-or-treating because I know a lot of you has wanted to see um, the kids trick-or-treating and in their costumes and uh, my little niece and nephew. They're so cute. And um, yeah, we had a really good Halloween. It was fun. You know, we trick or treat, we came home, uh, we ate, my mom and dad came over. It was, it was a lot of fun. It, it was a good weekend, but, uh, oh, that migraine just hit me out of nowhere. That was not fun at all. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to start working on this scallop part, which I cannot wait. And, um, I have some other things that I want to get done. But you know me, I see a new pattern. There I am. I gotta, I gotta start making myself finish things. I really do because it's getting out of control. And my husband's like, "You have project bags everywhere," and I'm like, "I know. <laughs> don't, don't worry about it." But um, yeah. So I hope everybody has a wonderful night. And I really did miss you guys yesterday. I miss hanging out with you guys. I love this. I love the yarn community. I love showing my stuff off. And, um, oh, and don't forget, we have uh, the give the mystery box giveaway coming up Friday. So if you haven't, go to that video and uh, make sure you are subscribed, you like the video, and comment down below. What would you pick? Michael's or Hobby Lobby? You can only choose one. Me personally, I would pick Michaels. I like Michaels. Lately, Hobby Lobby just, I don't know, doesn't do it for me. Michaels, oof, I love Michaels. Anyway, I'm a Michaels girl. Let me know what, you know, what you like. And uh, yeah, we'll be picking a winner uh, Friday night. And I can't wait. So, I hope everyone has a great night. And, uh... I'll hook up with you guys later. Mm -hmm.